It's been brought to my attention, I must say, in spite of all of Mayor's efforts, whatever you want to call him, a number of places still insist in running services where there is no toilet, and that's where they expect you to have a break. So, any time of night, any time of the day, any time of the year, there's no toilets there, and yet here we are having to go half a mile away just to go to the toilet when you get to the other end. They're trying to run a service, really. A service of what? Non-runners? Because that seems to be the way it seems to be moving forward these days. Whatever happened to, all right, you go to the toilet on a stand or you have a ferry that will take you to your garage, if it ain't too far, obviously, where you can then alleviate yourself if you need a toilet relief. That's both for male and female. Sadly enough, that isn't the case these days. You could be a Riva, you could be go alone, you could be a belly up, you could even be stagecoach. It don't really matter which, but each one of these companies, even Transdev, each one of these companies have this awful habit of sending drivers away to a designated route where, sadly enough, there is no toilet. Yes, there has been a few placed, but hang on one sec, Mr. Mayor, and this is directed for him, in spite of your efforts, you're still not doing the job. You've got companies taking a mickey left, right and centre. They want us to do miracle work with minimal brakes and, I might add, no toilet. What's your take on it? I would like to know. Speak to me later, or I'll speak to you later. We shall see.